Good afternoon, Southside, and welcome to another episode of Hawk TV. Today, we will take a look at the seniors preparing for prom, a video about Homestuck, a Falcon team member's birthday, and a music video and more. Don't go anywhere, you're watching Hawk TV. Welcome back. I'm Trill Curry. And I'm Chadarius Cannon. Some seniors are thinking about riding in style for prom tonight. Hawk TV reporter Corey Gage has the story. Prom is right around the corner. And to some seniors, the way they arrive is just as important as what they wear. I guess I'd, uh, I'd see if I could rent a limo or some really nice car. You know, it is senior prom. It's not going to happen again. Uh, my one issue, I probably... No, I mean, I'll probably pull out a Bugatti or something like that. You know, something expensive, something lavish. As you can see, luxurious vehicles would be a first for many seniors. However, they aren't as affordable as they would want them to be. Uh, like I said, it'd be nice, but they're really expensive, and I don't know if, I can, if I'm going to be able to do that, and I'm probably just going to end up driving my truck, but that's okay. Oh, uh, yeah, well, I don't know. You never know about me. You never know. I might, I might get something. Whether it's a limo, Bugatti, or any other special vehicle, if money weren't an issue, some seniors would definitely choose an alternative vehicle rather than their own. For Hawk TV, I'm Corey Gage. Thanks, Corey. The senior boys are not the only ones that have a lot to do before prom. Hawk TV reporter Stephanie Tipler has the story. Our class of 2013 senior prom is coming up soon. I sat down with a couple of senior girls to see how they're preparing for prom. I plan on getting my hair done, my makeup done, my nails done, my toes done. Then I gotta check up on my date to make sure he isn't tacky. Gotta take pictures with like four different people. I gotta do a lot of stuff. I am gonna wake up and eat a really good breakfast and drink a lot of water because I don't want to be dehydrated whenever I'm dancing and sweating. And then I'm <laughs> I'm going to get my hair done and my nails done, and then I'm just going to put my dress on and go. Well, I spent like $500 on a dress, like $100 on some shoes. Then we're going to have to eat at Asahi, but I'm not paying for all this. It's, just, it's a lot of money. Probably about $300. That's all. For Hawk TV, I'm Stephanie Tipler. Thanks, Stephanie. Stay tuned. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Uh huh. Pass the mic. Pass the mic. Uh huh. Pass the mic. One. Now we do it. Two. Pass the mic. Yeah, yeah. You. Big girls and whoop. Big shoes. Yeah. Pass the mic. Let's go. Pass the mic. Uh. Pass the mic. Let's go. Pass the mic. Okay. Pass me the mic. I don't like to ride a bike. Yeah. When I was a kid, I used to fly a kite. Pass the mic. Uh. Pass the mic. Okay. Pass the mic. Go. Pass me the mic. Uh huh. I'ma take flight. Uh huh. You three dog brothers. This brother light. Uh huh. Pass the mic. It's gonna be all right. Uh huh. Pass the mic. Let's go. Yeah. Pass the. Uh huh. Pass the mic. Let's go. Pass the mic. Uh huh. Pass the mic. What is he doing, bro? What the? Two chains, tall looking. This is Bruce next. Welcome back. Homestuck is an online webcomic. Hawk TV reporter David Scott will tell you how it works. Hey there. My name is David Scott, and in two minutes I'm going to tell you about Homestuck. Homestuck is an online webcomic created by a man only known as Andrew Hussey. Yes, webcomic, meaning online comic. It is over 7,500 pages long and covers many topics, character types, ideas, blah, blah, blah. 
It used many different sources of media to tell the story, from flash animations to games to reading segments called pester logs to simply pictures. It all starts with a young man on his 13th birthday, which just happens to be April 13th. Though he was born 13 years ago today, he is just being given a name, and that name is John Egbert. He is stuck at home, and from that point it just spirals out of control, detailing his day stuck at home and the events that lead to him entering the game called Suburb, which ends the world and throws him and his three friends into a multi-universe spanning adventure to save and create the ga a galaxy and universes and stuff. As their adventure goes on, they meet an alien race called Trolls who are actually from like another universe or dimension and have a lot to do with what originally happened to the original four characters, along with their own stories and backgrounds. There are many enemies that they face, including characters such as Jack Noir, Beck Noir, Jack Noir is a half dog thing, and I don't know, don't ask me, Lord English, a giant universe destroying green skull monster who kills ghosts, yeah, he kills ghosts with lasers, but anyway, the adventure spans many, many pages and is to end this year, along with celebrate its fourth birthday. Anyway, go check it out. Or I don't. I don't care. Have you read Homestuck? Yes, I have. How far are you? About 20 pages in. Do you like it? Yeah, I like it quite a bit. Do you think it's funny? Yeah, so far, yeah. Who is your favorite character? I haven't really met all the characters, so I don't know yet. So you like John? Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, David. And I hear this small music video by our very own Montreal Curry. Between you and me, we were made for each other. Now ain't that plain to see? Do you love me or do you love him? I know the mother guys want you, but I ain't them. Now I know this ain't the wrong time. I love you for a long time. I want a woman that can be with me, that I can call mine. Baby girl, you are my destiny. Just to have you next to me, yeah, that's the recipe. Yeah, girl, you know I really need you in my life, my forever and a day, and someday you will be my wife. But seeing you around town with some other guy, it makes me wanna leave something I don't wanna try. Goodbye. I met a lot of Miss Little's physical science class learns how light converts energy in, in a pretty fun experiment. Hawk TV reporter Kristen Long has the story. Miss <laughs> Lisa Little's physical science class is making solar cars to demonstrate how light is converted into energy. We built them because uh, we're learning about solar energy and physical science. Luan King knows how the car works. Like basically, you just get energy, throw energy from the sun to put in the, the solar energy panels. Tyler Williamson knows what the light is converted into. Produces energy. Although the solar cars in Ms. Little's class are just models, they demonstrate how solar power saves electricity. 
and is an efficient source of energy. For Hawk TV, I'm Kristen Law. Thanks, Kristen. Now we will see how well students know their principal with Hawk TV reporter Erica Berry. How well do you know your principal? Three students here at Southside High School were asked a variety of questions to know how well they know their principal, Miss Tucker. What high school did your principal graduate? Southside. What college did she go to? Lambeth. Does she have any kids? Um, well, I know she has one. I know Mamie Tucker, but I don't know of any other ones. What sport did she play in high school and in college? Basketball. When is Miss Tucker's birthday? It's coming up. I know that. Her birthday is this weekend, so how old do you think she's going to be? 52. Do you have anything to say to Miss Tucker? Happy birthday. Do you have anything you want to say to Miss Tucker? Happy birthday, Miss Tucker. Do you have anything to say to Miss Tucker? I'm out. <laughs> For Hawk TV, I'm Erica Berrigan. Thanks, Erica. That's all for this episode of Hawk TV. Tune in next week. Happy, Happy birthday, Miss Tucker. Tucker.